Allah doesn't need anyone. Allah doesn't need anyone. Allah is al Malik. Allah is free. Antum al Fukara Allah. You are the destituted ones to Allah. People walking around with an attitude. And no, I don't have to pray, I don't have to fast, or even worse, I've been fasting, you know, for 10 years, praying for 10 years. How come Allah doesn't give me this? And how come Allah. What, you think Allah owes you something? You think Allah owes you something? You think Allah needs you? Allah doesn't need anyone. Allah doesn't need anyone. The Prophet of Allah sitting with Sahaba, sitting with the greatest Ummah that ever walked the earth. The greatest ummah that ever walked the earth. Authentic hadith. And this is well, my opinion or the opinion of the ulama and the mashaykh. Allah sends down Quran speaking about Sahaba. He says, I am pleased with them and they are pleased with me. The Prophet of Allah in the authentic hadith. In the authentic hadith, the Prophet of Allah sitting with Sahaba. He says to them, I see what you don't see and I hear what you don't hear. He says, He says, the heavens have squeaked and they have every right to squeak. So Sahaba are amazed. What do you mean, O Prophet of Allah? What do you mean that the heavens have squeaked? What do you mean that the seven heavens have squeaked? You know, my brothers, because mashallah, Today we've become a people of science and logic, you know. Everything we know about astronomy is not even 1% of what's really out there. And our solar system, our galaxy is one of millions and millions that are out there. And in our solar system alone, in our galaxy alone, one of the scholars was saying, he says, there are so many stars in our galaxy alone. I'm not going to tell you what's ours is one of millions. So never mind the millions. Our one alone. He says, in our galaxy alone, there are so many stars. You know, the sun is one of the smaller stars that are in our galaxy. And the sun alone is millions and millions of times bigger than the earth. So the scholar is saying, if we were given one second to name every single star that is in our galaxy. You ready for this? You will need 300 trillion years and you wouldn't name every star that is in our galaxy. And all this is in Samawatul Ula, is in the first heavens. The Prophet of Allah is saying the seven heavens have squeaked and they have every right to squeak. Why? Why are Prophet of Allah why have they squeaked? You know, sometimes you put a lot of weight onto something. So it starts making noise. It starts giving way because he can't carry the load. The Prophet of Allah says the seven heavens can no longer carry the load. The load of what? He says, There isn't room in all these heavens for four fingers except there is an angel in prostration to Allah. And you think Allah needs your money on the way out, huh? You think Allah cares whether you pray or you don't. There isn't room for four fingers in all the heavens except there is an angel in prostration to Allah. Angels, from the moment they're created to the moment they stand before Allah, one continuous sajda, they never did anything else, one continuous sajda for billions of years. Yet when they stand before Allah, they say, oh Allah, forgive us. Forgive us, Ya Allah, for we did not give haq to your ibadah. We didn't give rights. We didn't worship you the way you should be worshipped. And you and I think that Allah needs us. People walking around with a big chip on his shoulder, with an attitude. My brothers, Allah Azza wa doesn't need anyone. Allah doesn't need anyone.